Hi, my name is David Kemp. This presentation, in my opinion, is an overview of what I believe is how corporate governance should be applied in Council. Governance is the establishment of policies and continuous monitoring of their proper implementation by the members of the governing body of an organisation. It includes the mechanisms required to balance the powers of the members with the associated accountability and their primary duty of enhancing the prosperity and viability of the organisation. Since the City of Victor Harbour is deemed to be a corporation, then corporate governance is the system of rules, practices and processes by which a company is directed and controlled. Corporate governance essentially involves balancing the interests of a company, many stakeholders such as shareholders, management, customers, suppliers, financiers, government and the community. Corporate governance is the process in supporting innovation, corporate efficiencies and the continuous improvement of services. Elected members are the governing body of council and are there to ensure the administration effectively achieve the outcomes for the benefit of the community in the following areas. Deliver consistent and clear strategic policy, direction and to ensure effective management of all human resources guarantee effective management of financial resources and ensure effective management of assets. Make certain effective management of risks and effectively manage corporate projects. Promote our services to ensure effective management of business support services. Provide clear reporting on our achievements and continuously improve services. I would seek from the administration as part of the financial quarterly re review a report from each business unit, what are the risk, financial positions and delivery of projects, key planned activities. The quarterly review will not be part of the ordinary council meeting, but a special meeting held four times a year for the directors and managers to deliver their report to the chamber, followed by a question and answer session. I believe this will bring to the elected members the status of the budget and the performance of the council against the annual business plan for that year. If I am elected, I will act to introduce the new format of quarterly financial and business plans reports to the Chamber. Thank you. Written and authorised and spoken by David Kemp, 30 Clipper Court, Encounter Bay. South Coast Television, your community your voice.